Can't say I'm going to make a good sound or not, but I'll see how far I can go first of all anyway. Well, the accident before it started, I was on a drunk that night anyway, and uh, which I shouldn't have had, and I went out and partied. So we were going to Rouen looking for some more, some more pot, I guess, or you know, acid. So for some reason, I was looking at the highway, and I seen met three cars coming down the highway. First, I, I looked down to see how fast I was going, and I was going 60 miles an hour. And then I looked back up, and after that I woke up in the hospital. And that was it, and I said, whoa, what the hell's happening here, right? And once I came out of that, well then, the time even got longer, but still I had to talk to a psychologist to tell me what, the, what was going on, and well then I had to go try and reflect on that and try to say, what the hell is this, you know? I only knew most of your life in bed, you got a lot of thinking to do, right? Because <laughs> how it would be to not feel your toe or your finger, right? They can't tell me that. They, I know how you feel. No, they don't. Feel this, you know what I mean? Feel that. They look at me cross-eyed, upside down. I don't give a shit, you know? It's me. <laughs> My dad told me a lot of times, you know, you better smarten up or you'll never get yourself a girlfriend and it's what happened, right? If I only realized it when I was 13 when I first took that drink of beer, right? Because somewhere, somehow, if I had the courage and possibility of doing the changement for myself and other people, well then, you know. I'd like to be able to try. I wanted to push my chair across Canada because I heard of uh, Rick Hansen, right? And then I wanted to go go into schools and tell these students, I guess, and about taking these drugs and stuff like that because I don't want anyone to be sitting where I'm sitting. Not even my worst enemy. So if all the kids will understand that drinking beer, taking pills and, well, smoking pot, if that's what they want to call dope too, but just be careful and watch yourselves and what you do. Learn to love one another, hang on. Because life ain't going to be all that easy after a while. As we all see, we're going to have to learn how to share. And that's what makes me stronger. I don't think of back there. I think of what's in the ahead because if I was to drive this machine backwards, I wouldn't see nothing, right? That's the same way. You got to keep your eyes straight ahead at all times. I, since my accident, couldn't play the guitar anymore until my cousin introduced me to this here. Like I said, when I'm alone, I make this machine cry to me, you know what I mean? This is my baby. But the only friend I really have is this one right here, right? I have no complaints, no fights, no arguments. I hope she loves me the way I love her. <laughs> but I'm gonna make music and I'm not finished, you know? I'm gonna try to get my cousin up here and with the drums. We'll set them up out here and stuff, we'll, we'll show. And together we call ourselves Chief, you know what I mean? Creator holds Indians everlasting future. Thank you. And Brian, in, in abbreviation, is brave, runs yelling all nations. Till then, if you want to hear more music, come and see me at home. I practice every day if I'm not out driving. Right?
whoever's up there is holding and sustaining this man right here. That's it, guys.